Good morning, close and staff. This is Samantha with your morning announcements. Our character trait this month is cooperation. Cooperation is when two or more people work together to achieve a goal. When you cooperate, you work together to reach a common goal, despite possible differences, and you listen to one another. Teamwork. Legs. Dreams work. Any students who are fasting for Ramadan are welcome in the library during lunch. Continuing our staff interview series, Montserrat and I interviewed Ms. Nichols, an eighth grade English teacher, to learn more about her and her path to Kilo. We hope you enjoy. Hello, Ms. Nichols. My name is Samantha and I'm a seventh grader. Hello, Ms. Nichols. My name is Montserrat and I'm an eighth grader. Hello, ladies. I'm Ms. Nichols. I'm an eighth grade ELAR teacher. I will be asking the first question. What advice would you give to any students who want to be a teacher? If students want to be a teacher, they need to learn one, I guess, patience. Depends on the grade, but you definitely have to have a lot of patience. Make sure that you do your work because if you're not learning, you can't teach what you don't know. You have to have a lot of patience to be a teacher. <laughs> this is true. What benefit do you personally gain from teaching? From teaching, it's very beneficial for me personally. I feel like I'm making a difference. I just started teaching about seven years ago. So for me, I was working in the world of non-teaching and I saw that I wasn't really doing much that I felt that was making a difference. Helping kids learn, be future leaders is what I feel is beneficial for me. What do you like the most about teaching? I like the kids. If you had me as a student, you would know I like to play around with the kids, but then of course, get them back on track. And I like to see them interested in participating and then we get excited about what we do. What do you dislike about teaching? I hate all the non-teaching paperwork. So all uh, the things that don't really serve us any purpose in life, basically? <laughs> I guess you could say that, yeah, all the extra stuff we have to do. Instead of preparing our lessons for you or grading for you, helping you, you know, there's a lot of extra stuff we have to do. So, of course, that's not the most fun thing to do. What is the most useless talent that you have? I would say knowing random facts about useless things that I just throw at my students, which they'll find interesting, but then it gets us off topic and I have to swing us back into the context. Can you share one with us? So I was telling my students, I have four dogs. Pretty much my life is my dogs. So I was explaining to them one day how when a dog puts its paw on you when you're petting it, that's the way a dog is petting you back. So something like that, or when a dog uses the restroom and they look at you, that means that they trust you to protect them while they're vulnerable. So stuff like that. Those are some good facts, I guess. <laughs> Useless. <but good. laughs> exactly. What do you do in your spare time then? In my spare time, when I have spare time, I play soccer, I go to the gym, don't get to see my friends a whole lot because of what's going on right now. But when I am able to, I try to hang out with the friends sometimes, go to lunch or dinner. But really, mainly right now, it's just going to the gym and playing soccer. So you get a lot of exercise from playing the soccer, right? I do, yes. And I'm exhausted afterwards. <laughs> but it's worth it. It's pretty nice having a hobby. Yeah, it is. I also like to read. I guess I should mention that. I love reading. Ooh, what type of books? Everything but romance. I'll pretty much read anything but a love story. Why? Why not a love well, story? Well, they're such great. It just doesn't, you know, I need something that's going to make me like, what? What's going to happen next? Well, thank you for taking time out of your day to come and interview with us. Thank you guys for interviewing me. I really appreciate it. It was good talking to you guys. It was good talking to you, too. Thank you to Ms. Nichols and thank you, Kilo students and staff. Have a waste not Wednesday.